Hello everyone, welcome to the nation and today I have a pretty exciting video. First off, I just want to say I am in uh, the new room that I will be moving into very, very shortly as you can see. We have it all cleared out. We still have to uh, get new carpet and paint the walls and stuff. But I thought I might as well just show you guys a little bit of what uh, the room is going to look like. I don't know if this will be your perspective when um, I uh, get completely in here and um, I'm making videos on the desk and everything but this is the new desk right here that I'm using and um, I'm excited because today we have something big we have got a PlayStation 4 Pro unboxing for you guys today now I recently just bought this at Best Buy and um, I'm super freaking excited to get into it and um, to cut it open not cut it open to uh, cut open the box and uh, get to the opening and start playing with this baby so I'm gonna bring it over here right in front of the camera and we're gonna open it up open this first box and slide this off slide the pretty off and now I got this big white part I'm gonna open this box I'm gonna probably open this and lay it down like this so I can uh, kind of show you guys everything. Um, quick start guide, don't need that. No one ever does that. And uh, pull this little thing out. And uh, just because I like to keep the suspense up and I like to uh, go exciting things. Second, I'm going to open this up and here we have the plug-in cord for the PlayStation 4 Pro. It actually looks a little bit different than the plugs do for the other PlayStations or, or the PlayStation 3 and 4 I noticed. Um, got another one of those kind of not that great PlayStation headsets. Uh, got a charge another charging cable for my uh, controller and that's going to be really useful. And then in here if I can get this open. Alright, yep. We've got the brand new controller. They do have a minor change. I do have an HDMI cord as well, which is very nice. Um, nothing more than that. Uh, they do have a slight change to the new controllers of the PS4 Pro. They um, added a little bit of a light bar up at the top, just like a little line that lights up so uh, you can see what color this is without like flipping your controller up. Feels really nice, feels about the same. Looks like they changed the colors and stickers a little bit, which is really nice. It's got more of a matte finish right here on the, on like in between the buttons and D-pad instead of like a shiny, which I like that better. It won't get as many fingerprints on it. And um, overall, it feels nice. It feels just like the uh, old ones. I like it a lot. The buttons are a little bit springier as well as far as the options and share buttons. And like I said, it has the uh, light on it, so... That's very nice right there. And now we get to the big part. This is exciting. Wow. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and take this off. All right. Let's get this off and this off. And go ahead and open this up. There's the front. So I'll go ahead and flip it over. So, oh, that looks so nice. I'm so excited. Um, now, they changed the look of this as well. If you didn't know, on the bottom now, all the rubber things are no longer like a big line. They're now like little X's and triangles and circles and squares, like the PlayStation buttons. Back here on the back, I'm not sure why that little sticker is there. I guess that's that might be the hard drive or the replaceable hard drive or whatever. Um, and so they brought back the optic because they actually took off the optic cable um, as far as with the PlayStation Slim. Um, they got the LAN and they got a USB in the back which I really like because now I can plug it in my headset to the back and not have to worry about it sticking out in the front. Then they've got the optic cable, the uh, PlayStation camera port, HDMI and power port which is like I said a little bit different than they have been in the past and if you look it up like this or put it up like this it's a shiny like a chrome PlayStation symbol there you can see my camera 
my brand new camera that I got for Christmas. It's the first video I'm actually using it on. And then if you look at the cross section, it looks like pancakes or waffles or a layer cake or something like that. There's a little port here. It has like an X, X triangle square and circle. And the circle is like a little port. I don't know what that is. Interesting. Um, and then here on the front, they changed it. There are actually little buttons now. So you got the button line. It's got the power button and the eject button. As well as the CD drive, obviously. And uh, the two other USBs. So... I am super excited to get in and start using this um, in my setup as opposed to the uh, older PlayStation 4. Uh, I'm going to be selling the older play PlayStation 4 on eBay. Um, I can link it if I get it up on the earth. Later on I might link it because the video will go up before I have it listed for sure. Um, but here's a sick new baby. I love it. I can't wait to play it. Hopefully we can get some 4K games and gameplay as well because I'm excited for that. I'm really excited to get her get her going and uh, use like or, or use the LAN cable and uh, transfer all my data. That's going to be a long 80 minutes or however long it takes, hour and a half. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you leave a like and subscribe and join the nation if you haven't already. And um, I will see you guys in the next video. And I want to thank you guys so much for watching and for all the support. Peace.